Guys, and good Monday morning to your face. I um, I'm sorry I wasn't here last Monday morning, but um, I was actually I was sick. And I know I've told you before that you know <laughs> sometimes when I say I'm sick, it's because you know I my leg and it's big and complicated. And but it wasn't my leg. I I actually was I was I had a virus. I don't know what it was, but um, it all of you know how inside your body there is fluids, and then sometimes they all come out at once yeah that was uh, that was me for uh <laughs> for a few days there so i i'm sorry i didn't uh didn't get to you last monday but that's okay we gotta come on gotta do our monday dance let's get this going no 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 uh, oh and i've got got a picture for you um you know mouse sometimes will send me boxes of of gifts and i i like unbox them right he sent me this picture uh he thought it would go really good on this uh on two bits because I mean, shortest story story ever, Monday. And here we are in the middle of it. Oh, and by the way, thank you guys. It even <laughs> You scared me a little bit because I was talking about, you know, I showed you my plushie on the last episode and I was like, this is my plushie and, and it is cute. And I don't know if you, you guys are probably out there going, well, that's kid stuff. You guys nearly um, mobbed me over that. In the comments, you guys are like, how oh, dare, I have tons of plushies and I love them all and don't you dare say, I, and I'm like, oh. <laughs> sorry, I am so sorry, I did not know. So I'm, I'm glad there's uh, other uh, older adult plushie lovers out there besides myself, uh, because they're, I don't know, I think they're cute, I think they're awesome. They help me get through my day, and now I'm gonna help you get through your day Let's take a look at your world. Ah, lovely desert morning, lovely desert Monday morning. We're in over the, you probably, no. <laughs> okay, um, right then. You know, that, that is, that's a perfect way to start out this Monday because isn't that the way that Monday is? It's like, you see it coming, you know it's coming, here it's getting closer and you're like no pull up eject but you can't and you just get an eye full of monday and then you're like damn it and then it starts all over again oh dear what? What? <laughs> what? Uh, have you have you noticed that about some cultures uh, other like foreign cultures is that that Anytime that something happens to the wife, she'll always hit the guy over it, no matter what it is. If some, some llama will strangely back up and just take a shit on a girl and she'll turn around and slap the teeth out of Lorenzo. You know, I don't, I don't know why. Is it, I think it's some kind of um, different expression of love. At least I'm hoping that. Oh. <laughs> what do you did he think he had a crocodile on <laughs> Pardon me while I pull so back out of the slick. <laughs> oh, uh, okay, uh, look, I'm not, I'm not an experienced fisherman, but, um, I, uh, I can, I, I think I can guarantee that there are no elephants that live at the bottom of a lake. Yeah. <laughs> Why would you need to pull a foot of fish is this big? It's, were you trying to jerk it in <laughs> Before I can have any, uh, conclusive proof on, um, the stupidity of that videos, I, I need to get more experience fishing because I, I don't know a whole lot about it, maybe. Maybe that happens all the time. <laughs> I hope not. Ah! Ah! 
Uh, I mean, Jesus, it, okay, I get... Uh, I get that's kind of funny, but... That's kind of nightmare fuel right there. You know, if I, if I woke up and s that was staring at me in my room at night, um, somebody would shit my pants. Okay. Oh, oh, we lost the boat. We lost the boat. Oh, oh, <laughs> we lost the trip. This guy just, oh my God. Okay, that, <laughs> that guy didn't, that wasn't just Monday. That was like, this guy got double Monday. That was, I can't believe. He lost, he lost the boat, which that was bad enough. And, and then the forklift of what that was. Oh, he just destroyed everything. Oh man, I, I don't, I hope that never in my life do I destroy that much at once. At least not on accident. When I was a kid, you could go to a store with just one dollar, come out with four comics, four candy bars, two packs of trading cards, bag of chips, and a cold drink. Now they just have cameras everywhere. <laughs> yeah, I'd love to deny that about my childhood, that, uh, but no, that's, that's kind of the way it was because you'd go in and it, the person behind the counter at a, a convenience store is usually where you did this. They didn't care. They were sitting in the corner, smoking pot. They didn't care if you stole. And, but there was a rule, and I don't know why. You had to buy something. You had to buy something, anything. It's like, if you just walked in and stole stuff and then just tried to walk out, they'd stop you. They'd be like, nah, no, you can't. But if you walked in, filled your pockets with crap that you didn't buy, and then grabbed like a soda and a candy bar and bought that, they'd be like, see you later. They didn't care. As long as you bought one thing. Uh, the strange times we used to live in. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh, oh, there she goes. Uh, have you slid yet? I mean, have you slid down the stairs or down your dr driveway or something like that just because, you know, you walk outside, it looks like it's wet, step on it, and off you go. I, I It's happened to me a bunch of times. Not this year. Not yet. But um, hopefully that's about to come to an end. Spring is coming. Hopefully we won't see people sliding downstairs, at least until next year. Pumping with uh, some expensive gas. Well, I don't know if there's any cheap gas right now. Just starting out. Um. Oh no, he's motor home. I'll be back in a little while. We'll oh, what do you guess? What do you guess is gonna run? I'm gonna Almost guess about a thousand dollars. I'm gonna guess he's filling up his tank. See, look at that. He's already at six hundred dollars. My God. Oh. We'll be back. Wow. Oh. That's, he's already spent more than my monthly rent and bills already. Look at, I was close. I was close. Man, needed a little sticker right there that says, I did this from, uh, from uh, Mr. Biden, right? Um, it's, oh, but, oh, wait, I'm sorry, I forgot I, my fault. This is Putin's fault. Gotta remember, gotta remember it's Putin's fault. I don't want to get banned off of YouTube. Ooh! All right, all right! Now that's a dad. I mean, dad laying there, taking a nap, sleeping, kid starts to fall, and before he hits the ground, dad's already got, that's, that's what you should expect from a father. Really, it, it is. I mean, I, and I've seen that happen before. Kids will start to fall, boom. Dad, dads will just pull them right, right before they hit the ground. That's just, I don't have that instinct because I've, you know, I've never had a kid, but man, impressive. It's like superhero shit there. Yeah, super dad. I think that's doing. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. Take, take one go. Okay. Is it gonna. What the fuck? I could taste that before I even put it in my mouth. Good. Oh. 
<laughs> you know, I gotta, I gotta ask why. Why does, why does that happen? You know, you put something sour in your mouth, and one side of your face is like crunch. Why? Why does? Why does it do? Why don't other flavors do things like that? Like, you know, you taste something sweet, then half your head caves in, and taste something bitter, and your butt collapses. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know why that happens. It's funny. I wonder, I wonder if the flavor of Monday would cause, you know, your nose to just blow. I, I don't know. Putin withdraws from Ukraine after celebrities threaten to sing Imagine. You know, I don't have a problem with um, how famous celebrities get. I don't have a problem with they have a huge paycheck. I don't have a problem with any of that. What I think celebrities need to realize is that they are not as important as they think they are. I mean, yeah, you're actors. That's great. That's awesome. But it doesn't mean that you, know, you can get together and sing one of the crappiest songs ever written and it's gonna stop all the bad in the world. I mean, how important, what, what important stick have you shoved up your ass at this point? Listen, celebrities, actors, just act, just sing, just perform. And when it comes to the rest of the world, just fuck off. <laughs> Okay. Wow. Uh, you know, I'm I'm a little surprised. I mean, I, I've seen the motorcycle dominoes falling down in movies before, but I didn't know if that was real. I thought that was just like a movie trick or something. I didn't know that would actually happen. Apparently, that's a real thing. And God help you if you did that outside of a biker bar. You, you'd have Hell's Angels putting cigarettes out in your dick for years. Man, everybody on FaceTime talking about you like Steve Harvey. Hey. Oh, that's look, a filter. You look like Steve Harvey? Huh? Oh. Hey, what's wrong with you? Huh? <laughs> I should not laugh at that. <laughs> but I. <laughs> Man. Oh, that is just mean like as hell. Hey. That is look, just mean as hell. You look like Steve Harvey? Huh? <laughs> hey, what's wrong with you? Huh? <laughs> oh, that, <laughs> that right there, that was mean. That was really, really mean. And, and you could cause somebody to punch their own face off if you do that to them. So, <laughs> so don't do it. And if you do, send it into the show. <laughs> Uh, oh, 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 look at him go. Oh, look at him. Go. <laughs> okay. Hey, I got to give that guy points. I mean, at least he didn't fall on his way. He was surfing that. And you know what? That's the best way to do it. Trust me from experience. When you get up there and you realize that you're on ice, don't try to stand up. Don't try to stop. Don't try to do all of the, either of those things. You will fall on your ass. What you do is you hunker down and you just surf it. You just keep going. And if there's a truck going to run over at you at the end, at least you'll do it with some dignity. No more of this just falling downstairs like whoopsie. No, just get taken out by a semi. Just YOLO. Uh, oh, okay. Mm, oh, oh, no. Oh, oh, no. Oh, wait, they're on a cruise. They're on a cruise ship. Oh, no, you are so boned. How are you, how the hell are they gonna get her out of that? And they're on a cruise ship. What are they, they're just gonna stick a big vacuum to the top of that slide and just suck her ass out? What? Oh boy, she's gonna get a good view of the ocean for a little while, isn't she? Damn, though, Herr Mozart, might I suggest more cowbell? You know, I love classical music. I love all kinds of music and classical's one of them. I love Mozart, but I have to admit, not one cowbell, not once. In all of his musical career, not one cowbell was used, not once. And I think that if he had used more cowbell, he'd still be on the radio today. We'd be jamming with him still. People still be talking about how awesome Mozart is today. I turn on the radio and it'd be like, you know, some techno remix of the Magic Flute or some shit. I don't know. 
Okay. Yeah, this is very responsible. Well. Mm-hmm. See, uh, th th there's, a, there's a message here. And it's usually the guys who do this, the, the, the husbands, because the, the wives will say, go out, get, get the expensive garbage bags, get the thick ones, the, you know, the, and the husband will come home with these cheap as hell garbage bags, and then that will happen because sometimes it doesn't matter how much, it doesn't matter, like, if, if it's salt, it doesn't matter, it's salt. Garbage bags, that will happen if you buy cheap garbage bags. I know that. I have spilt much garbage in my life just from that by itself. I wasn't responsible enough to clean it up like she did, but we don't talk about that anymore, do we? Mm. Oh! 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 Do we actually have a face grind here? Ah, oh, we do! Oh no! Oh, oh God! Yeah, that's that's no good. And the kid took it like a champ too. He's gonna go home and you know half your face is numb, and it's just it's all cut up and swollen and looks like Jack Frost just slapped you across the face with his balls. <laughs> it's not that's not a fun time. Okay. Okay. D does anybody else want to slap that surprised look off this kid's face? Is it, is, or is it just me? I mean, I understand if people get into accidents, they fall down, they do something stupid, whoops, but well, I don't understand when people like are doing something and they know the result of it is going to be disastrous and then it happens and then they go, what? You kids, I look, somebody needs to let me in on this. Do you kids, are, are you looking for the stupid? I mean, maybe that's cool now. I, I don't know. Explain it to me, somebody. Let's see if I'm smart or stupid. Oh, that's the Republic of Cyprus, isn't it? Oh, well. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's the Republic of Cyprus. I, I don't blame her though. I'm not gonna suggest that this person was stupid for not knowing that because that's that's kind of a hard one, but well, from from my day back from when we used to go to school, they used to teach us this stuff. They used to teach us where the countries were and what they looked like and where the cities were and all this kind of stuff. And they used to teach us that. What is, what is it? What are they teaching you now? That's what I wanna know. This study the other day that came out that showed that only 11% of high school students have a proficient reading level? What are you doing? What are they doing to you? I mean, I know you're there for what? Six, seven hours a day, sitting in chairs? <laughs> Come on, what are they teaching you? What are they doing? You gotta tell me. Honestly, I just think you're all in there smoking pot. That's what I think. Well, I wish I could go with you. Just <laughs> there. Shut up, stupid. It's right there. <laughs> dumb. You dumb animal. <laughs> oh my god. Look, I'm not gonna say that other animals don't do this. They do, but I... I... I don't understand where you cat people come from. It's a mystery to me. When I was young, I was poor. But after years of hard work, I am no longer young. There's not a lot, <laughs> not a lot I can say about this. Um, my personal uh, goal in life, I, I learned a long time ago not to try and become rich. I've learned just to try and take care of yourself as long as you have a roof over your head and food in your mouth, spend the rest of the time trying to be happy, trying to enjoy every day. Because if you go to these rich people, they, they're gonna say that they didn't enjoy their life. They didn't have a free moment. They don't even know what life is. I mean, sure, you may die with $400 trillion, but you may have never had that moment where you're trapped in a basement wearing a diaper with two donkeys. Who wants to miss that? Yay, we 
perfectly stupid machine. <laughs> no. Uh, and I noticed he had a chair there. Open it and save him. I mean, first of all, he was older, so he was kind of he was kind of smart to hold on to a chair. But second of all, stupid for getting on in the first place. And the chair was like, "Fuck you! You're not taking me down with you. I am not as dumb as you are." The chair is actually more intelligent than he was. That's kind of sad. Oh no! <laughs> and hold up! Why, my goodness! What is that? What is that he's wearing? I do believe that's a quest. I think that's an Oculus quest. Hmm. Do I have a theory going on here? Maybe I do. I'm not so sure about the intelligence of the people who buy Oculus quests. In fact, I bet every single one of them have a Facebook account. <laughs> oh! <laughs> um... I don't think somebody read the installation instructions proper long. Although that would be really cool if you had a little rave in your room, just put some different colored lights in there, turn that shit on. Nice. But um, I'm pretty sure, even though I'm not an expert at this, I don't think that was installed correctly. And guys, you know what? I don't think our week is installed correctly either. I think Monday should be in the middle of the week, just so you can have good and then bad and then good again, instead of starting out bad. That, that just sucked. But that is your world for this week. Guys, I'm sorry that I was gone uh, last week. I really am. Um, and I love engaging with you guys. But um, yeah, I was was pretty sick. Um, now I'm feeling better now. No need to panic. Don't You don't have to give me CPR, but you could. So put your foot down, put the pedal to the metal and go through this week. It's your first day, make it the best day. I found that if you make Monday the best day of the week, it can't get any worse. Just make Monday the best day. Go forward. Do what you do. Do it the best that you can. I know that you will. All right, guys. It's always good seeing you on Monday. I'm happy to be here for you. I'm happy you're there for me. And uh, I will see you again next Monday.